In this program, we're going to learn about the avian digestive system. The avian digestive system is found in birds and poultry such as chickens, ducks, sparrows, and eagles. A digestive system is the system by which ingested food is acted upon by physical and chemical means to provide the body with absorbable nutrients. Even the smallest animals need to eat and drink. In some unicellular creatures, ingestion occurs at any point of the body. Because they have no mouth, these single-celled organisms ingest nutrients through a process called phagocytosis. Phagocytosis is when a cell takes in a large object that it will eventually digest. These creatures do not have a digestive tract. They store the ingested material in structures known as food vacuoles, where the nutrients are absorbed and waste products are then eliminated through a temporary opening in the cell membrane. One of the first types of digestive tracts was the gastrovascular cavity that is found in cnidarians like jellyfish and sea anemones. In a gastrovascular cavity, food goes in and waste comes out that same opening. Food enters the gastrovascular cavity where enzymes break down the food used by individual cells. Waste material is then ejected through the same cavity. From the gastrovascular cavity evolved the alimentary canal, a one-way digestive tract with two openings. Scientists believe that the first animals to have the alimentary canal were microscopic worms called nematodes. From nematodes, the alimentary canal evolved, resulting in many different types of digestive tracts. Arthropods are invertebrate animals whose digestive functions take place in specialized cavities that are connected to form a continuous canal. The alimentary canal includes a foregut consisting of the mouth parts and esophagus, the midgut or stomach, and the hindgut where undigested food is excreted through the anus as feces. Virtually all vertebrate animals have a digestive system with an alimentary tract. Different species of animals have different digestive systems. There are four basic types of vertebrate digestive systems. Avian, monogastric, ruminant, and pseudoruminant digestive systems. Digestive systems of animals have adapted to the kinds of foods eaten, the methods by which food is obtained, and the energy needs that an animal needs in order to survive. Chickens, ducks, geese, pheasants, and other birds have an avian digestive system. A chicken is an omnivore, eating both meat and vegetable matter, and uses its beak to gather small grains, grass, or insects for ingestion. Birds cannot chew food. The main parts of a chicken's digestive system include the mouth, esophagus, crop, proventriculus, gizzard, cica, stomach, small intestines, large intestines, and cloaca. As the food moves from the mouth into the esophagus, saliva and digestive enzymes are added. These begin the process of digestion. Food moves from the esophagus to an expandable storage compartment called the crop. Food trickles from the crop to the first part of the bird's stomach called the proventriculus. Here enzymes and acids are added and the food is passed on to the muscular part of a bird's stomach called the gizzard where the physical grinding of the food occurs. A gizzard uses small, hard particles of sand or pebbles to grind grain and other food into smaller, digestible pieces. From the gizzard, food passes into the small intestine where nutrients are absorbed into the bird's body. Residue is then passed into the cica where bacterial action helps break down undigested food. From the cica, the food moves to the large intestine, which functions to absorb water and dry out indigestible foods which are then emptied into the cloaca. Animals have different digestive systems. The avian digestive system found in birds is designed to get food in the body, digest the food, and absorb the nutrients necessary to live.